fantastic that we've got this technology showcase here in Oxford uh, today. It's going to involve the creme de la creme of all of the medical researchers from the university and across the region. Uh, we will have the opportunity to see the great activities and innovations that are being created, which are being exploited by a fantastic innovation ecosystem, particularly organised by Oxford University Innovation, who commercialises all of the university's intellectual property. We're really excited of being here because we're here to tell you about what we're doing on digital health and primarily precision health. It's all about what we do is mapping your personal health spaces, mapping the environment as well as your vital signs and other conditions to ensure that we can increase and improve clinical outcomes as well as re reduce costs while we're doing it. So it's also about allowing the audience to know more about how we're translating through a strategic relationship with the University of Oxford and Oxford University Hospitals NHS Foundation Trust, that technology that has been created into the market. So we're here also to tell you how we're commercializing those discoveries. The ability of the university and the hospital together to partner with industry for training, for education, to drive innovation is an important aspect of uh, this afternoon's program. And of course the university is making a uh, physical investment in enhancing our capability to work with industry. This event on precision medicine is really important. Precision medicine, there are two pillars to it, precision diagnostics and precision medicine effective therapies for patients. One of the examples is whole genome sequencing and they're obviously a big national program now, the 100,000 Genome Project from, led by Genomics England that we've been very involved with here in Oxford. The BRC in Oxford has led on uh, some of the pilots um, that really explored how we can introduce this novel and you know, destructive technology into routine diagnostics. Um, and so that's a, a way of really delivering precision medicine because you can't do it without the diagnostics.